Good afternoon, y'all. Wanted to show you quickly how to do smart previews uh, for Lightroom. This is the Creative Cloud um, Classic. If you have imported your images and they are on the computer you are on, in working on currently, in the histogram, you will see this that says original. Now, I have already made smart previews of these, um, but I'm gonna show you how to do that really quickly. It's super simple. Go to your library module. Uh, if you're not there, hit the G button. And then you're going to go up here to library and down here to where it says previews and you're going to just click build smart previews. Now, you're going to want to make sure that all of your photos are selected so that it builds the smart previews from the originals and you have to be connected to the, to the folder on the computer that has the originals in it. Now, once you have built smart previews, um, it's going to do it very quickly on this computer because those are already done, um, under the catalog, you will see, uh, that's probably in photos on this computer or pictures, um, you'll see the catalog, you'll see this also that says catalog smart previews. Um, now this one also has previews, but if you've built one-to-one -one previews and you want to send those along, these three items is what you're going to need. The catalog, the smart previews, and the previews. Now if you just want to do the previews and the smart preview or previews in the catalog, do these two. The easiest thing to do is to right click on those and to compress those. Um, if I could find it on this computer, there it is, compress two items. Now what that's going to do is a zipped folder with those two items in it. Now you can send this uh, likely in an email because it's not gigantic um, if it's just for that, like if it's just for that wedding or that, um, that one uh, session, but if it's huge, put it in a Dropbox and then you can send this Dropbox link to your person. So if you are working on editing, you need to send your photos out to be edited. You want to work on them off of a laptop. Um, once you build those smart previews, you will see in the histogram that this is now a file in Lightroom as an original and a smart preview. Now, if I delete the originals off of this hard drive on my laptop, say I'm going to put them onto my external hard drive and just work off my laptop, this will just say Smart Preview. Smart Previews have all of the same editing capabilities um, and they are fully functional as far as Lightroom is concerned. Um, so you could send them off to be edited, they can edit those, you can bring them back and see all the edits. Um, and the same thing, when you get that folder back, all you're going to do is replace that catalog and those Smart Previews um, wherever, or those smart previews, really, you don't have to replace the catalog. You're going to replace those smart previews into this um, folder, and then when this catalog opens the next time, it will pull those smart previews as edits that have been made. So hopefully that makes sense. Shoot me a message if you don't understand uh, or you have some questions, but that's a real quick overview of how to make smart previews.